Welcome back to another episode of The Next Odd Creature. This is Chino Artaleza Cipriano. We already heard from a lot of talented artists from episode 1 to 3, and honestly, we are overwhelmed by the amount of good music that we received, and we're so grateful to each and every one of them. But tonight, another five finalists will be participating, and we're excited to hear their music. And of course, still joining us tonight are our judges from the last episode. We have Mark Thompson, Martin Riggs, and Kian Cipriano. Hello! Simula na natin to. Alexina is a 22-year-old singer-songwriter from Desmarina City. Here's her song, Enough is Enough. Chris on the phone. Oh, no. Astro. Love and could be a crime. Still, your heart will leave you crying. Yet, every time your lips come into mine, die. I know how bad it goes, cause I'm a masochist. You've had your fun playing your games. Your ways, yeah, you feel me, ties it such a shame. But baby, enough is enough. I finally came to my senses, won't let you get in my head. Watch me step out of my comfort zone. And realize that I'm so good on my own Take it easy, I ain't Giving you a taste of your own medicine That's what I'm flipping to your game Now I'll be up, don't even try and change Honey fingers, I ain't the one to Sarap. Sarap nun. Pang... Ano production? Ano ba? Nakakamiss, ano? Nakakamiss mag, ano, lumabas at gumimik. Tapos, people watching. Tapos may tama ka ng konti. Alam mo yun. <laughs> Di ba? Yeah. May ganun yeah. siyang, ano, sa akin. May ganun siyang pakiramdam. Ano, may nakakamiss pumunta sa isang lugar na na medyo madilim than the usual, di ba? Yep. May ano, may, may, siguro kaya ako sinasabi to parang, kasi it, it, parang it, it gives me this parang sensual feeling. I mean, don't get me wrong. Pero may, may ganun siya na, I mean, there's nothing wrong naman with that. Pero may ganun siyang pakiramdam eh, na basta, I mean, sexy, kumbaga. Di ba? Yeah, I think that's what the artist is going for. Um, medyo, medyo biased. I kind of know who this person is. Funny enough, I had no idea they were auditioning for this. Oh, cool. So, yeah, yeah. So um, I've heard their group, Astral Astral Mind, and they're mm-hmm. they're I know they're creatives. They just put songs together, put videos together. So I totally dig this. I think I think the vocals, yeah. like malapit na siya. 
I mean, like, like it just needs a bit of tweaking, Pero. Yeah. It's almost, it's almost fully baked. It's all, it's, it's almost there. I think just leveling. Cause I, I really like the quiet parts, yung yung sa sa dulo, sa, sa intro. Just, mm-hmm. just, ano, just more vibey. It's dope. Super dope. Love the beats. Super love the beats. Sa akin, it's like ano, um, parang tipsy pop. <laughs> kung meron kung meron genre yung kung meron genre yung ganung klaseng music para sa parang siyang... brand ng ice cream yun ah <laughs> tipsy pero pop. parang tipsy pop parang ganun siya sa akin eh, na parang hindi ka pwedeng hindi tipsy pag ito yung music na naririnig mo parang what's ang pangalan ng bar na yun na nasa the fort may isip, early nights early nights er, er, parang parang yun yung pangalan ng bar parang dapat nandun yung music eh so parang may lugar yung music mismo may ano Martin may ano may lugar. Okay, okay, okay. May may lugar yung music na Ne ne ne, parang iba yung pagkakasabi mo kanina. Mark, narinig mo ba 'yon? Narinig ko 'yan. Narinig mo yung yung lugar? <laughs> lugar. Lugar. Ganun ka ba nadala nung ano? <laughs> Oo, oh, eh, na BGC. Na BGC ako ng music. Ano ka ba nadala ng music na para nagkaroon ka ng braces na Oh, shaker. Lugar. Uh, ano? Parang a sharp sharp. A sharp na music. Ay, ba yung, ganun, yung, ganun yung effect nung kanta ni, ano? Nung una nating uh, artist. Tumatama What's your name again? Siya. Alex Sena, si Alex. Alex. Diba? Yeah. Si, ganun ka, te- ah my God, sobrang powerful nun. To the point <laughs> na yung isa sa mga judges, <laughs> ena pa lugar. <laughs> Yeah, diba? Lugar in BGC. Matindi. I found my place. I found oh, my place. Martin, go, 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 go. Sige, going back to the lugar. Well, uh, it's sexy. Uh, may vibe na sexy yung kanta. And um, I think that's nice. A little work lang din sa vocals nga siguro, kagaya na sinasabi ni Mark kanina. Na, konti pa. Konti pa. Kahit yung panning sa, kahit yung panning sa monitor headphones, parang hindi pa siya ganun maani. Hindi pa siya ganun umiikot ng solid pero a little more work I think it's gonna be smooth. Yeah, I, I agree Martin. Ano lang eh like konti na lang. It's just really levels, maybe a little bit of tuning tapos placement. It's it's almost baked. Alam mo yung malapit na siyang pwedeng i-release. It's just it's so close. It's super kaya na eh. Just a little rework kaya na. True. It's priceless to see it na, na nasa ganyang stage though. Yeah. Yeah. Ako type key music. Alam um, gusto ko yung ganyang vibe. Alam mo yun? Parang, um, sarap niya pakinggan sa dagat. Sarap pakinggan habang nagda-drive. Ang sarap pakinggan pag, uh, kahit nga ano eh, kahit nga umaga, pakikinggan ko yan eh. Nagkakape ako. ba diba? Pang boost ng ano, pang boost ng... Doesn't matter what you're looking Sobrang chill nung kanta. Bro. Sobrang chill nung kanta. Pero yung effect niya nga, bukod sa lugar ni Martin... <laughs> <laughs> na ano kanya na parang dinadala kanya sa place na, ng good mood, di ba? Yeah. Mm. Dude, video din kailangan niya. Like it needs a video with the song. Parang uh, uh. Speaking of video, Mark, may palabas ka na video, di ba? <laughs> may plug, yeah. Ayos ba? Ayos ba? Ayos, ayos, ayos. Ayos yeah, we, we got a music video coming out for a song called Healing and we recorded the whole thing with cell phones. So, can't wait for you to see it resourceful exciting naman brother congrats pabaan namin yung healing under OC records yeah <laughs> galing ng segue oh, dude <laughs> see <laughs> diba ano yan cellphones ginamit nila sa music video so very resourceful very resourceful okay sige proceed tayo sa next track our second artist is a five piece rock band hailing from a small town in Silang Cavite here are Sundays of September with their song Prontera featuring Jansen. <laughs> Sabayan ng matapang ako ay pinalanak Sabayan pa ng mga unos kami pumapadyak Sa lugar kung saan mo makikita ang iyong anino At kung saan mo makikita lahat ang yung tinatago Ang daming bagay na nangyari sa paligid Kung ito tinitibag at kalayaan na ibinigay sa'yo Huwag kang susuko iho, huwag pang hinaan ang loo Ito'y magsisilbing magpapatulog para iso
Natatakot at kabado Mga plano na nabago Ang pangarap na naglaho Di ko na alam kung paano Makapasok ng trabaho Nakikita na kung paano Tayo ginagago ka po natin mga tao Damay pati empleyado Di na sila makatao Abang puta ba't ang labo? Puta pre ang baho Hindi mo na alam saan ba dapat na itago Ang lahat ng mga bagay na wala katuturan Kahit pa iwanan mo Hindi mo na babalikan Di mo matutulukan Kaguto man lang naman Komplikado mga bagay Di mo masolusyonan Ikay nagtanong paano ka naliligaw Ang kalabang di makita di mo mapapalitaw At ikay nagtanong paano nga ba bumitaw Ang kalabang di makita di mo mapapalitaw Kung saan mapagpad Kung saan lumipad Tayo Ako kasi lumaki ako sa ganitong era eh. Ano eh, parang nung panahon na pumasok kami sa music industry, mga 2006, ganito yung most itugtugan ng mga banda. Alam mo yun? Um, yes, baby. Okay. <laughs> diba, kinikwento ko lang ganun ako, ganun time ako pumasok ng music scene tapos kausap ko na yung anak ko ngayon, ba diba? Anyway, um, hindi, kasi yung, yung time na yun, um, parang, I think it was an era na um, puro alternative pop rock, um, tapos ganyan yung ganyan tugtugan, heavy on overdrives, tapos mga bagsakan, uh, Uh, alam mo yun, may, may gano'n na energy, may gano'n na siguro face nga yun, no? So, very familiar ako sa ganyang sound. Parang pinagsama-sama yung mga, yung mga banda nung early 2000s, early mid 2000s. Parang uh, noong una, parang medyo, yung, nung pumasok yung vocalista, medyo dicta license na, alam mo yun, gano'n yun sa akin na may, Nagtumugtog na yung uh, pre-chorus. Akala ko ngayon pre-chorus, yun na yung chorus eh. Yeah, yeah. Bigla nag-chorus na. Though, to be honest, for me ah, for me lang naman, tatayo yung kanta kahit wala yung chorus na yun. And yeah, it could yeah. have been a totally different story. Pero dahil nilagay nila yung chorus na yun, yung yung nagpa, 
yun yung nagpa-pop dun sa song. Di ba? Nung, nung ano, parang, uy, ah, okay, gets, gets. And parang naging ano siya, naging uh, commercial. Di ba? Di ba? Pero kung tinanggal mo yun, parang magiging iba eh. Di ba? Yeah. Magiging, ano siya, ibang atmosphere talaga. So, ako, ako, type ko siya. Um, I just feel like, um, kumbaga somewhat, somewhat predictable yung, yung ibang parts. Pero again, dun yan, nung binali niya yung chorus na yan, parang, uy, okay, hindi ko expect yun. I was going for the, for the darker, darker sound. Pero nung nilagay niya yung chorus, lumiwanag eh. Yeah. Diba? Naging, ano, naging, uh, parang, hopeful yung song. Parang ganon. So, yeah, okay siya sa akin. Um, ano ba? Uh, feeling ko lang, kung nagkaroon ng ibang, ibang uh, twist yung kanta, mas, mas naging special siya. Parang ganon. I, I don't know about you. I, I like the fact that it was fully pr- produced. Like mm-hmm. the drums, the the guitar, everything. Ibig sabihin parang if if they can keep this up and sila sila yon, they can be self sufficient. Yeah. they'll they'll always be able to come out with music because they can put their songs together mm-hmm. and not rely on anyone else. I, I think I think that's dope. Chaka, um, I was born from Silang Cavite, so shoutouts to those guys. <laughs> Great. They're they're from there, dude. Took me back. Took me back. Tapos the the notes, the chords, everything was balanced. Trip ko siya. I, I, I really think it. na eh, no? Yeah, fully baked. Tapos may rap part pa. It, it, it kind of gave me like a, a stick figures vibe. Mm. Ano yun? Yeah, it gave me a little bit of that. Tapos, I, I feel like they're fully baked. They're ready hey, for hey, release. Favorite ko yung bridge. Yun yung pinaka ano sa akin. Nag-stand out sa song yung bridge. May, may iba siyang atake. As, yeah. Ito yung ano, I don't know if you'd agree with me. Ito yung tipong banda na kung kasali ako ng Battle of the Bands at sila yung tumugtog before us, oh. manginginig na yung tuwod. Yeah. Alam mo yung gano'n. <laughs> Parang eh, hindi yeah. na kayo na. Kunin nyo yung trophy. Di ba? <laughs> Parang yeah. gano'n. Sana may sense yung sinasabi ko. Yeah, I wouldn't want to follow Sobra. up. Sobra. <laughs> gets, gets. Kasi kompleto sa rekados eh. May rapper, yung bagsakan, yung mismong areglo ng kata. Alam mo, yung banda na nakikita ko sa big stage, something na good. Kumbaga, big show na mala, mar, maraming crowd. Das alam mo, kaya nila mag-perform. Nasa kanila yun. Kumbaga, kahit hindi ko pa sila nakikita, just hearing the music. Para yeah. nag-gets ko yung ugali nung mismo, uh, nung artist. Yung kanta, tama yung sinabi ni Sir Kian. Um, predictable, which is nice, which is okay. Um, except sa chorus, na nagbigay nga ng ibang feeling dun sa kanta. Sa akin naman, um, you can take this, for me lang ah, um, you can take this two ways. Um, meaningful yung kanta. Pero I don't mean it um, as a negative comment or a, as a positive comment. Kasi sa sobrang meaningful ng kanta, hindi ko alam kung nung kakapitan ko. Hindi ko alam kung nung ibig sabihin mismo ng kanta. Parang kailangan niya ng lyric video na malinaw para makomprehend ko talaga kung nung ibig sabihin. Kasi ang daming sinabi. So parang hindi ko alam kung saan ako makikinig. May kinig ba ako dun sa music o may kinig ako dun sa letra? Pero alam kong meron siya sinasabing kailangan ko pakinggan. Which is I think the point of the song. Na, kailang, na it needs to get the message across. So parang dun sa part na getting the message across feels wise, yes, gets, may contrast, uh, may kailangan mangyari, may kailangan i-achieve, may kailangan magbago, okay. Um, clarity wise, parang kailangan natin ng uh, a little more work on that. Pero good job. Yeah, yeah. Because, Martin, I I feel like I feel like they're the kind of group though that will like parang hindi pa ito yung yung the song. Pero I feel like they're a group who has the potential to come up with the song. Kasi, the song. Yeah, from oh. from from the sound of it, and then sila like fully baked. Like they they can take it wherever they want. They got the chords down. They got mixing mastering down. They got the the vocals. They got the whole thing. I don't know. I, I feel like I don't know. I feel like they're fully baked. I feel like y- yun lang naman. Yeah, maangas, angas yung ano? Yeah. Angas yung so. Oh, oh. Gusto ko malaman kay Kate Daniel kung kumusta sa kanya yung vibe. Kumusta sa kanya yung mismo kanta. 
Um, yung entire song, nagandahan po ako. And yung feels niya, yung una ko naalala, parang um, yung mga movie or teleserya na may mga superhero. Para, para pong ganun. So, I really like it. I really like the entire song. Yun lang po. Thanks, thanks. How about you, ano, Rona? Hello, 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 hello. Can you hear me? Yes, yes, we can hear you. Okay. Um, it's like rock steady yun the thing niya. Tapos, um, siya cool. Parang mix po, full package. Ano <laughs> na pag ganun na lang si Rona eh. Parang rock na lang siya eh. Oh, parang ang ganun, no? pinagsama-sama yung mga iba't ibang rock band sa kanila. Or era. Oo. Oh. So, galing. Ano, proceed na tayo sa next song? Okay, next song please. Our next artist is another five-piece OPM band with alternative pop rock as their genre. Let's listen to Instant Jam with their song, Tila Panghabang Buhay. Gusto ko malunod sa pag-ibig na lang kung mayroong sa aki sa sakit. Gusto ko mahulog sa pag-ibig na wagas yung hindi Love 
Ganda nun. Wow. Ganda nun. Smooth. <laughs> Smooth. Parang pang red wine. Pang slow dance. Oo, parang pang prom. Di ba? Ikaw, so, parang ano lang din. Um, ang lambing ng boses ng singer. Tapos, ang linis niya, linis niya kumanta. Ang ganda rin ng vibe na binibigay nung 6-8 na palo eh. Alam mo yun? So, parang, parang pasasayawin niya talaga tayo dun sa mismong groove na yun. Though, kung meron akong ikinagulat dun sa song, kasi um, easy listening na yung kante eh. Smooth na yung buong sound trip eh. Pagdating ng bridge, eh, for me lang, um, parang harsh yung pasok ng electric guitar. Nung mismong solo. Parang nag enjoy na akong pakinggan yung boses ni ate. Pero dun sa part na yun, medyo nag-agaw ata sila ng... Uh, nag-agaw ata sila. O hindi ko alam kung ang intention ba nun, pampasexy ba siya nung song, or... Um, may ganun ba siyang vibe? Pero it came out a little too harsh. Baka may pwedeng ibang effects, baka may pwedeng ibang tunog. Parang dapat naman talaga meron. Pero parang na-harsh lang ako sa part na yun. All in all, I think um, pangsayawan yung kanta, slow dance yung kanta. Pang vibe, pang candle night kind of uh, night. Tapos may part nga na, may part sa akin na alam kong 18 to 22 years old yung makikinig nung kanta. Parang, parang, alam mo yun, parang ganong age yung makikinig ng song at kikiligin dun sa mismong kanta. Yan, yan, yan siya sa akin, Sir Kian. Yeah. Panglandian eh, no? Yeah. Oo. Oh, oh. Parang ganon oh, oh. yung term ko, ha? Pero, di ba, yung tipong paparinig mo sa taong may intention ka, di ba? Tipong, pakinggan mo to, please. Di ba? Tapos, huwag kang makinig na iba, <laughs> muna pakinggan mo. Di ba? May parang pwede siyang ganun eh. Tsaka, pangalan nila instant May mga tao diba? nag-instant jam, sir. Oh. Bagay na bagay sa kanila yung pangalan. Kasi ito yung kanta na tipong, kahit hindi kayo magkakabanda, tapos pag kumanta na yung vocalista, gitara na siya, tapos paluan na ng drummer, papasok na yung instant jam talaga. Alam mo yun? Sim- Kaya ako sinasabi yun kasi, Simple yung song eh. Simpleng simple siya. ba? Diba? Pero, ang nangibabaw yung message, pati yung pakiramdam. Which for me is the most important thing when it comes to music. ba? Diba? Yung, yung pakiramdam na, na gusto mong i-deliver. So, galing, galing. Ikaw, uh, Mark Thompson TV. Dude, I sorry. <laughs> may may vibe siya, dude. Feeling ko timeless tong record na to. Para siyang you can release it 5, 10 years from now. It'll still sound fresh sa sa ears ko. Like it feels timeless. I could have released this 10 years ago. It still fits. Alam mo yun, um, the voice sobrang unique but like I've heard it before but in a good way, ah. like like I, I, the voice sounds super familiar. Tapos yeah. yung, yung, I, I agree with Martin. I think the guitars are loud, but I think at the same time, it could have been the contrasting thing sa song. Alam mo yun? Like, uh, it's so smooth. Baka kailangan talaga. Baka kailangan uh-huh. ng contrasting para hindi siya flat the whole time. Alam mo yun? That little spike para it sticks in your brain. Uh, that could be a choice. Pwede rin you could turn it down just a little, pero the song super, 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 super timeless. Yeah. Make or break ang ano nito. For me, uh, make or break ang live nito. Oh, oh yeah. Diba? Yeah. Depende kung paano nila dadalin yung music eh. Kasi kung um, hindi mo siya mapaperform or deliver sa tao the way they imagine it, parang oh, nga, make or break. Kasi diba? it's a good song. Mm-mm. Pero very, total, nasa stage tayo na sina sound trip natin. More on talagang pandinig muna, it's diba? The, oh, it's the music. Yeah. Oo oh, oh, eh, yun talaga eh. I mean, I think yun naman yung whole point nitong ginagawa natin na hindi muna natin sila nakikita kasi uh, at the end of the day, music talaga yung papakinggan mo eh. Di ba? Yeah. And yun din mm-hmm. yung itong, uh, the next odd creature na maano yung uh, lahat ng senses natin pagdating sa pakikinig at paghahanap ng isang artist. Di ba? Um, yeah. Not to sound too preachy, pero 
may ano siya eh, uh, itong the next odd creature, ang goal talaga natin dito is mahanap, kumbaga yung, yung proseso, yung proseso ng kung paano kikilatisin yung isang artist, di ba? Um, kaya, kaya thank you, thank you sa inyo, thank you rin sa Oddcom, thank you sa mga nanonood niyan. Kasi, at sa mga artists na nag, nag-submit ng entries nila, out of hundreds, eh, ito yung ano, ito yung uh, nasala natin. And again, we're so privileged na, na marinig yung mga songs nyo at this point in your career. So, thank you rin sa tiwala sa OC. Um, pero mabalik ako dun sa sinasabi ko kanina dun sa song. Parang ano eh, um, kung, kung titignan mo yung climate ng music industry ngayon, eto yung napapansin kong tunog na very now. di ba? You have your mm. AK Labaho, your Rob Daniel, you have your... Alam mo yan, yung, 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 yung ganong sound niya. Parang, uh, yung sound, very old school yung vibe, di ba? Pero, naririnig ko siya madalas ngayon. Yung ganitong tunog. Uh, for some reason. I don't know kung naririnig nyo rin. Di ba? Pero may, may ganun siya. May ganun siyang feeling. So, okay yun. Tama yung sabi ni Mark. Timeless. Di ba? Yeah. Okay. Martin, ikaw. Anything you wanna add? Um, very now. Yeah, oo. Pati yung edad ng mga tao nga. Gaya na sabi ko kanina. Parang yung edad ng mga tao na 18 to 22 years old now, yung makakadig talaga ng music na to. Na parang, ewan ko, parang tutunog siya sa playlist nila eh. After nila pakinggan si Ulap, parang ito yung kantang kasunod. <laughs> parang, parang may ganun siyang vibe sa akin. So, very yeah. Spotify, no, Martin? Very Spotify. Yes, actually. It sounds very, very like Spotify, Spotify playlist. Yeah. Very playlisty. Very playlisty yung kanta. Sa playlist na yun, anong lugar siya? Oh my gosh. Um, BGC. BGC tsaka ka tip. Tanong tayo sa sa Ashcroft. Kumusta sa iyo yun? Ano? Um, Ann. Kalalista Ann. Kumusta sa iyo yun? Sorry, nakamute kaya ka. Or may static lang ata si Odin. No. Okay, okay wait lang. Problem. Sige, balikan okay. natin dyan. Technical difficulty lang. Or, Ann, pwede mo i-comment dito tapos we'll read it for you. Comment mo, comment mo yan. Comment mo yan. Si, ano, sino mo pwede tara? Sino gusto mag, ano, magsalita sa song? Si Hana. Parang di niya in-expect. <laughs> <laughs> Ang ganda na sandal niya eh. Oh my gosh, it's me. <laughs> Ako po, ano, parang pang solemn night po. Parang pang uh, chill, chill night, gano'n. Yan na po. Okay. Thanks, thanks. Thank Pati you. Thank you so you. much. Sorry, Fatima. Fatima, nastorbo kaya ata namin. Mukhang may... <laughs> <laughs> yung gulat niya, legit. Sorry, sorry. Ito na po ba? Narinig mo ba yung song, Fatima? <laughs> sorry, medyo nalutang. Oo oh, po, narinig ko. <laughs> <laughs> Parang Fatima, ha? Wait, ako pala yung sinahog. Kumusta? Kumusta? Ano? <laughs> Natatawa tuloy ako. Ano po, uh, parang it reminds me ng time na parang babago pa lang ako na in love. Parang gano'n. Wait, so, so hindi ka na ngayon bagong na in love? Hindi na po eh. Hindi <laughs> 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 pa ito yung magkakasabi ah. <laughs> parang nasakta na. <laughs> okay. Pero di ba yun yung video yung na-feel ko dun sa song eh. Kahit ano na, kumbaga parang kahit hindi ka na asro as kung sino ka before. Di ba? Refreshing. Di ba? Oh, yes sir. Oh. Sabi nga ni ano ni Anne, di siya makapag-comment kanina. Reminds me of City Navarro daw. Yung boses siguro, no? Relaxing eh, no. Medyo mm. po maliit. Parang kailan lang nakikita ko sa Twitter, tinatanong nila ano raw apelyido ni City. <laughs> ano sagot mo ulit? Ano ulit sagot mo? <laughs> oh, okay. Eh. Ano na? Ano ulit sagot mo doon sa Apelido ni City? Ano na ano ko doon eh. Anyway, sige na. Nag, uh, nagkokornihan na tayo dito. Uh, next artist, please. Sa City Lights eh. <laughs> Pinilit pa yun. No? Now let's take a short break and I would like to introduce our next odd creature. 
who has a special message for aspiring odd creatures. Hi guys! Ako po si Eugene Layug at gusto ko lamang pong batiin ng lahat ng sumali dito na good luck, galingan nyo palagi and sobrang galing nyo lahat. Pinapanood ko lahat ng mga episode at syempre, huwag na huwag nyo po kalimutan i-stream ang landiin nyo na ako on all digital streaming platform. Maraming salamat! Good luck! Up next is a singer-songwriter and also a public school teacher. His music genres include R&B, hip-hop, pop, and acoustic. Here's Cedric Evaristo with his song, Gamu Gamu. Alam kong maraming kilay ang tataas sa mga sasampitin. Nais ko lamang ay maghayag ng aking salusbi Dahil kung mayroong mang malalang sakit ang bayan natin Yun ay walang ibang lunas, hindi ang muling pagkisig Paumanhin sa mga sasabihin ko Marami lang mga bagay sa akin kumulo Bibihira lang naman magkumento ng ganito Bato-bato sa langit ang tamaan niyo Wow, that 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 will stick in my brain. Grab it, grab it, dude. I I I'm I don't know <laughs> why. Dude, like that was a lot. That was so much. But man, that was so many genres put together. That was like the effort was there. I still can't believe he's a teacher. If he was my teacher, sobrang lit niya naman. <laughs> I wonder what subject he teaches. Baka lit. Literature. <laughs> Literature nga. Kung Pero math dude, teacher siya, magtataka siguro. <laughs> <laughs> Pero yung, yung chords, ah, like that's very like, alam mo yung first lesson mo sa music class. Uh, yung, yung parang, 
I don't know. He's he's got that teacher vibe. Pero yung message niya, yung message niya was was there. The the production, man, the effort the effort was there. That was the the speeches. Intense, dude. Intense. That's all I can say. It's intense. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait. Sige, Not... uh, ano tayo? Mag-unmute tayo lahat. Lahat na nandito, unmute tayo. Sabay-sabay tayo. Sino yung artist na... Pagbila ko ng tatlo, ha? Tsaka nyo sagutin, ha? Sino yung unang Pinoy artist na na Okay. One, two, three. Glock nine. Glock nine. Glock nine. Glock nine. no? So, di kaya ako tinanong din kasi nga parang very um, evident yung Glock nine influence niya. Kung, I mean, kung sasabihin niya na hindi niya influence si Glock nine, magtatagugulat ako. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, parang, ha? Huh? Paano nangyari yun? Di ba? Pati yung word, yung parang kung paano yung yung cadence niya yung yung pagsasa pag uh, pati yung pagbigkas niya mismo ng mga words ano eh may may Glock 9 feel which is good di ba kasi si Glock naman talaga has influenced a lot of rappers di ba pero um, tama si Mark parang it's somewhat a lot um, gusto ko yung letra Gusto ko yung mensahe ng kanta. Yeah. Yes. Gusto ko yung sinasabi niya. I mean, very timely. Diba? At totoo. Totoong totoo. And I, I admire his balls. Yeah. Or, yeah. Yes. I mean, oh, I was that about to say sounds balls. so good that I admire his balls. Pero, I admire his, ano, kumbaga his balls na sabihin yung mga, ano na yon mga bagay na yun, diba? Yung passion. Na, mm. Malalim siya. This is like a, this is a track that you have to listen to. Hindi siya yung yung you're going on a road trip tapos you're you're waiting for jams. It's 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 a uh, conscious conscious yeah. uh, word. Very uh, conscious. Conscious you have to, is a like, good word. Yeah. You have to pay attention. I think I think ano lang, sorry I have to add. Parang I feel like less is more. Like uh, I feel like I know the message is there na and the production there's something there. Pero like I feel like it, it needs to take some stuff away naman. Yeah. To hmm. let it Glue para makapag-focus tayo sa sinasabi. Oh, oh, oh yeah, yeah. Sigo, yeah, uh, uh. ba kayo pag sinabi ko na sana hindi na niya nilagay yung huling part? Oh, kasi ano eh, um, kasi pagdating doon sa huling part, papalakpak na sana ako eh. Uy, hindi pa pala. Oh, 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 na- oh, lumapit yeah. na ako eh. <laughs> <laughs> Kaya, Uy, hindi pa pala tapos. Hindi pa pala tapos. Yeah, Mga yeah. tatlong beses niya ginawa yun. Sabi ko, oh, okay, okay, okay. So, hindi pa siya tapos. Uh, oh, creative decision niya yun. Creative license niya yun. Go ahead, go ahead. Pero yeah, yeah. same vibes naman, Sir Kian. Kumbaga parang, Parang tatayo tong track na to kahit wala yung dulo. Pero kung gusto niya talaga ilagay yun, baka may ibig sabihin sa kanya. Pati yung note na kumaliwa sa dulo. Para... Sa dulo, nagulat ako eh. That question no. siya, di ba? Hindi siya home eh. Parang... Oo oh, eh. Ano Parang alam mo yung ano, pe- period na yun eh. Question markan niya oh, ako doon sa last note eh. Parang sabi ko, oy. So, hindi. Uh, ad- period na yun, kinolon niya sa dulo. <laughs> Ah, masakto yun, sir. Masakto yun. Which reminds me, no? Na- natuntuwa ako sa mga artist na talaga merong uh, bayag para sabihin. Uh, sorry sa lack of term. Pero um, sa merong balls para sabihin talaga yung gusto nila sabihin. Um, kagaya ng butante importante ni Kian Cipriano at ni Max Importunate na out now on all streaming platforms. So pakinggan natin, guys. At magre-rumihistro tayo at bumoto tayo. Um, I think yung main point ng uh, sinasabi nung... Uh, kanta is um, change. Though, meron siyang sobrang outstanding na linya na talagang tumatak sa akin. Sabi niya, ayokong sabihin na wala kayong hiya kaso ang problema na sabi ko na. Doon pa lang, tapos yeah. na ilaban eh. Mic drop na yun eh. Mga, hindi lahat ng songwriter kaya sabihin yun pero nasabi niya. So, good job naman sa kanya doon. Agree ako kay Mark na um, agree ako kay Mark na you really need to take some stuff away from the production para makapag-focus doon sa message. Kasi um, ang halaga ng sinasabi ng artist eh. Sobrang halaga ng sinasabi ng artist. And I think um, there are times na talagang gusto natin effort si production. Pero there are times na um, tatayo at tatayo yan. Depende sa letra at mensahe ng kanta. Um, message over anything else. I agree, I agree. Yeah. Sana ano, sana makarinig pa tayo ng mga songs niya. And tama si Rona, very brave. Um, 
But, unsolicited advice. Kung kaya niyang ilayo yung yung buong ano niya, buong sound niya kay Glockline, I think yeah. mas maganda. Yeah. Kasi mm, ba, mas... yung identity niya. Di ba? Yes, sir. Oo. Because so, mm. yeah. you're standing next to a giant. Di ba? Like, you, you mm. have to be different a little bit with right. the influences. Yeah. It's good to have influences, pero it's better if you find if you find your own uh, sound and identity while, you know, uh, working for your own music. Pero ang lalim. So, ang lalim. Ang trick. Ang lalim. Ang trick. Kung sakali, I mean, kung ano man, feeling ko lang, ang magandang gawin, lahat ng influences mo, pagsama-samahin mo, halu-haluin mo, lagyan mo ng konting paminta, lagyan mo ng konting asin, gusto mo, lagyan mo pa ng ketchup, kung gusto mo, ikaw na yun. Mm. Diba? The melting so, pot concept. Oo. Oh, so, or wag mo lagyan ng ketchup. Anyway, <laughs> next artist na tayo. <laughs> Solid, 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 solid. Odd comes out and again, enjoy kay Jan. Our last artist tonight is an independent artist from Bataan and has been releasing and making his own music since 2015. Let's listen to Artie with a mashup of his songs Langit at Desperado. Sardi, and this is for Rosie. 
Yeah. Hey, put your hands for RD, man. Man can sing. He nilagay ako na sa lugar ko. <laughs> anyway. I-eject po si Martin, please. <laughs> um, kayo muna, kayo muna. Ano, sa sound tripping ko yun. Like, buong araw on repeat, on loop. <laughs> to be honest, uh, ito yung kanta na zinoom out ako dun sa pagiging technical. Kasi pagpasok nung, pero konting-konting technical lang talaga. Um, pagpasok nung music, yung kick talagang sinipa ako literal. Eh. Ano yung parang pumiyo ka <laughs> yung pa <kick>. doon? <laughs> yung kick, yung kick talagang sinipa ako literal. Parang nasipa eh. so, parang, ka talaga siya. Oh, <laughs> it manifests, it manifests. So, uh, pero hindi, uh, sa sound trip talaga siya eh. Kumbaga... In enjoy ko lang kumbaga yung mismong music um napa napa vibe niya lang ako tapos i think um kailangan ko na mga ganitong music sa araw ko talaga pamparelax uh, sobrang pamparelax talaga siya tapos ang um, pang vibe pang friends pang pang chill ganun tapos ang ganda ng boses niya bukod sa ang ganda ng boses niya ang galing niya ring magsulat so yeah i think that's it i love this guy i love this artist dude The man can Mark. sing. What's up? He 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 can he can super sing, like uh, his voice is on there. The second record I like better, and it kind of reminded me of Sam Smith on the second record, like uh, yeah, in in, mm. in a way. That was he's he's fully there. I kind of would like. Well, this is just um, my personal opinion. I feel like uh, this is the the genre right now. Like uh, well, on on wave for example, or on the radio, I would like something more experimental with sounds just so it it's it's different because i feel like i feel like um uh the artist is is so talented that was it'd be nice to really be distinct because dude the man can sing he can sing <laughs> he can yeah. sing. sinabi mo na rin na ano ah parang sinabi mo na rin na gusto ko magproduce the music for this artist <laughs> yeah pretty much parang, yeah, parang doon na yeah. siya papunta bro eh. bagay bagay kay mark bagay oh nga eh oh nga eh actually ako naman, um, parang, kasi maganda yung song. Maganda yung song, maganda yung boses niya, um, maganda yung production, ganda ng beat, ganda ng everything. Pero, baga kaso may pero siya sa akin, na siguro hinahanap ko yung chorus. Parang, nung nag, nag, bigla siyang nag-shift to a different um, progression, Parang 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 sa sarili ko parang ibalik mo doon sa la 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 na 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 na. 'Di ba? I mean parang kasi yun yung yun yung hinawakan ko doon sa kanta eh. Yung dulo Doon nakakapit. Niya, maganda yung dulo niya eh. I mean, it's it's superb. The song is superb. Pero yun lang talaga parang bigla akong kumbaga nasa langit na ako pero bigla ako napunta sa purgatorio. Tas, oh, get mo, sorry sir, na realize ko lang bigla, na realize ko lang na, bigla kasi ako, tas, 'di ba? Gets mo, gets mo 'yung sinasabi ko na sobra, sobra. Lang bigla siyang na, na, kung binalik niya ako doon siguro, parang 'yun na 'yun. 'Di ba? Pero again, syempre basically arrangement dude. Oh, arrangement, arrangement siguro, 'di ba? Para artistic license naman niya 'yan, 'di ba? Pero mm. um Ayun lang, parang bumitaw ako, bumitaw ako sa bandang dulo. Kasi alam, alam niyo yung kanta ni Billie Eilish na Bad Guy, di ba? Yeah, uh, uh. Yung sa dulo nun, iba. Totally parang ibang kanta. Uh. Parang ganun yung effect sa akin itong ginawa niya eh. Mas mahaba lang. Pero dahil nga parang completely ibang kanta na siya. Hinanap ko bigla yung langit. Hinanap ko yung chorus niya na kinakapitan ko na ang sarap-sarap ng pakiraan, ang sarap-sarap ng biyahe ko. Diba, biyahe ko sa langit. Hmm. So, yun lang naman. But, really, he's a good singer. Guy can sing. <laughs> the, I mean, the, 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 yung composition, galing. Um, sarap, sarap pakinggan ng kanta. I think, ano sir, um, I think the guy can sing. Pero listening to your comment, parang nagets ko yung, ngayon lang, nagets ko yung nararamdaman ko mismo. Nung sinabi mong dinala niya tayo sa langit, tapos bigla tayong gumanon na realize ko yung point ng arrangement niya na may oh my gosh, natabi ko yung lalagyan ko ng biko. Sorry. 
sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> Ang tawag dito. Um, narealize ko yung point ng arrangement niya. Kasi yung second song, untitled Desperado. Wait, so, so para kanta yon? Yeah, that's two songs. Oh, yeah. sabi nung sabi ni sabi nung host natin kanina, um uh, it's a mashup of songs na Langit tsaka Desperado. So ah, yung create two separate. Songs. Hindi hindi ko na intindihan. So parang tawag dito, parang nagets ko lang na oo nga no, baka yun yung story na gusto niya sabihin for this. Na baka dinala niya talaga tayo sa langit tapos binagsak niya tayo para maging desperado Wait, na makabalik ko, sa langit. Yeah, hindi hindi ko gets na dalawa yung kanta. Kasi up niya, sir. Isa siya. 'Di ba? Pero yung point ba noon is parang yeah, mashup he, para malaki sa mashup. Oo. It's a mashup, sir. Parang kumbaga that's his vibe. He's showing mm. us that parang nag storytelling like. siya. Oo. Uh-huh. Yan uh, nga lang kung bakit sinabi ko kanina. Completely <laughs> tanggalin niyo na. Yun. Wala akong kay maniwala sa akin kung ganun. <laughs> I think he <laughs> Intentional na he made you feel that way kasi parang naintindihan ko rin yung nararamdaman ko nung mismo nagko-comment ka na sir wait lang yun 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 yung sinasabi ni Sir Kian na dinala ako sa langit as binaba ako kasi hindi ko rin maintindihan nung una tapos naalala ko okay so magaling magsulat si Kuya magaling din siya mag uh, magaling magsulat si Kuya magaling magsulat si artist uh, magaling din siya kumanta Ngayon, bibigyan ko naman siya ng props for arrangement. Kasi kung yun yung feeling na gusto niya iparamdam sa atin, na-feel ko naman yun, um, di ko lang alam kung yun yung dapat kong ma-feel. Kasi, o nga, parang dapat makabalik nga ako sa langit. Okay, Pero kung gusto... Kung yun yung dapat kong narinig. Kasi parang, para akong, na, kasi di, tinitignan ko siya as isang song. Hmm. Yeah, no? So, kung, kung like ako, someone like me, Napakikinggan ko yung kanta for the first time, walang disclaimer, walang kahit na ano. Hindi ko makukuha yung eksaktong gusto niyang sabihin. Dahil uh, 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 uh. tingin ko, isa siyang kanta. ba diba? kung, yes. kung ang goal niya is mabali niya o malagay ka niya dun sa ibang mundo dahil dun sa, sa pangalawang kanta, parang... Uh, Again, kung walang disclaimer, hindi ko siya magets. Uh, I, I think he's very like. I, I think he's very like playlisty. Alam mo yon yung yung basically showing us na his songs can be parang a playlisted. Playlist. Uh uh. Ako naman, I would really like to hear because I feel like I've I've heard um I've heard all I've heard these songs on Spotify. I would like it because he's so good. He's so good. I would like him to sound unique. Uh, his his own, alam mo yun. But like the the man, he can he can sing. But I I think I think you're right. The young young two songs, yeah. The first I like the second one. I like the second one. Kasi he had, oh, I like uh, the first one. Sana marinig na sana marinig ko yung songs niya ng talagang nakasenderecho. Yeah. Uh, oh, kasi na wala ako eh. Ani na na bigla akong, what? Diba? Yeah. Gets, gets, uh, yeah. Uh, honest uh, lang. I mean, just being yeah. honest. Napunta ka, napunta ka na sa zone eh, tapos bigla ka nag-zone out. Parang ganun yung dating eh, no? Oh, diba? Kasi, I mean, for me ah, yun di, I'm not saying na, kasi sabi ko nga, he's a superb artist. Diba? Pero dahil binigyan niya ako ng ibang, well, that's odd. I like it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I actually, agree. Yeah, I was about to say. Yeah. there for sure. Diba? I mean, that's what OC Records is all about. Diba? Pero if we're talking about like a single song na ganun yung diskarte. Kaya sabi ko, gusto ko marinig yung kanta. Like, ano ba? Yung la 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 langit. Kasi nandun ako eh. Alam mo yun? Nandun ako. Sorry kung pinaglalabang ko talaga. Pero... I mean, I'd listen to it all day. Gets mo. Pero dude, cool siya kasi he's basically saying um, everybody else got one song. I'm gonna put two in. Uh, yeah. And I'm gonna stand okay. out. I'm gonna put yeah. two songs in here. Just so you know, I can work. Uh, parang and that's a and I think that's a make or break. Uh, that's a make or break decision. Na parang um, okay, sige, bina- he, he's ka got us talking about him, di ba? He's, he's yeah. Got, like, yeah. Yeah. Him. yeah. 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 Oh. Uh, 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 u
Talagang dumaldal talaga ta- dumaldal talaga tayo doon sa pagpakinig sa mismo kanta. Kasi sa salita ako. Si, hello. Hindi na la 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 la. Taka dalawang ulit ka doon sa lalala. Lala. Mabuti tayo sa point. Dinala niya ako sa langit, tapunta tayo sa purgatorio eh. Di ba? Para sa kanila tayo doon eh. <laughs> Yun nangyari no. Sobra spontaneous like analyze na ng mash up, binigyan ko na ng ibig sabihin ng mash up niya. Pero dude, sobra na eh. Hindi pero I think ano kasi, I think um Oo, oh, oh. kumbaga, odd quality, um, that's what OC Records is all about. But OC also makes hits. Kumbaga, uh, may hit song sa OC. And kung tawag, hit song na yung, hit song na yung langit para sa akin eh. Kumbaga, nando na yun eh. Pero medyo nag-drift away dun sa part na yun. And syempre, sayang. Pero may follow-up siya. May follow-up record siya. He's got well, a follow-up. Yeah, pero honestly from from an ANR's perspective, kung uh, yung follow-up record mo, uh, siyempre gusto ko ipar doon sa una mong kanta na parang oh kahit different oh, teka, siya. Teka, teka, teka. My Zen, ikaw muna kasi hindi na kami titigil mag-usap. Sumusuntok na yung mga tao. <laughs> Great job, Arnie. Eh, kumbaga, kumbaga sa inuman, nag-away-away kami dahil sa kanta ka eh. Ikaw My Zen, ikaw mo. Air punch na yung <laughs> Maganda po sana if ano, if parang mas ano, connected siya yung sa ano, pangalawa po yung ano, mas maganda po if as in parang tuloy-tuloy siya na mag, oo magkaiba pero like yung basta same, same gano'n. Parang, parang part one, part two. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Ikaw, Raisel. Thank you, Maizen. Maizen from Butil ng Kanin. Si Rysel. Rysel. Kamusta? Butil ng Kanin, tas Rysel naman. Oo. Oh, yung Rysel naman, Admore na naman siya. Rysel. Kamu- yes, Rysel. Oo. Oh. Yan. Yan, yan, yan. Sorry po, mabagal lang po yung... Oo nga. Oo nga. Oh. <laughs> Gets. <laughs> Ayun yeah. po, uh, kasi po, para po siyang magkakonektado, ganun po, throughout the, throughout the whole song po. So, pero po, solid, sobrang solid po. Nice, nice. Thank you, Rysel. Si Enshrine. Masasabi mo, Enshrine. Uh, ayun. Actually, ayun, ang ganda ng boses ni, ni Kuya. <laughs> Pero yun, medyo nag-gets yung nung sinabi naman kasi nung start na yung about the mash. So parang medyo yun nga. Doon ko din nung in-explain ni Sir Kian yung na-feel niya dun sa, sa kanta. Parang doon ko nga rin nag-gets na, oo nga, okay langit. Tapos naging desperado ka pagdating doon sa second song kasi gusto mo malik na langit. So, okay din naman. Okay din naman siya for me ah. Okay din naman. Pero sana yun nga, parang medyo kung yun sa dulo, kung binalik niya dun, sana binalik niya yung, yung song ng langit. Parang medyo ano. Uh, ako, parang ano lang, siguro for the ending lang. Yun lang. Thank you, thank you. Wait, meron bang gusto mag-comment? Meron ba sa odd community na gusto mag-comment? Sige lang, uh, feel free. <laughs> Sound trip lang tayo dito. Si <laughs> Paolo, si Paolo. Natatawa ako. <laughs> ba ako ba? Ano, Paolo? Oh, no, look, look. <laughs> Galit din. <laughs> si Sir Pao. Galit Grabe din. na to si R.D. Ha? Grabe. Ito na nangyayari. Ha? He made us feel something, R.D. Ayun. Tama naman yung sa Sam Smith. Medyo awig sa gano'n. Tapos yung sa dalawang kanta, nabitin ako dun sa una kaysa sa pangalawa. Pero parehas okay siya sa akin. Tapos ayun. Tapos ayun. Thank you, Paul. No? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, yeah, I mean, uh, to be honest, it's a really good song. And the fact na pinag-uusapan natin siya, eh, maganda yun. Di ba? Oo, oh, yeah. kasi higa katas talking. Props din sa lahat ng um, artists, lahat ng songs na narinig natin today. Because um, per song, may iba't iba tayo naramdaman. Di ba? Yeah. Yung, yung variety... Uh, ang ganda um, kumbaga kung nasa concert tayo nasa isang bar gig tayo ngayon parang 
sulit yung ibabayad nating ticket kasi iba't iba talaga. Diba? Sabi ni Rona, odd creature it is po. Diba? And yun naman ang point nitong ginagawa natin kaya we're looking for the next odd creature kasi gusto natin makarinig ng bago. Gusto natin makarinig ng malupit. Gusto natin makarinig ng out of the box and yung uh, tipong mababaliw tayo. Diba? Kaya salamat sa lahat ng mga mga songs uh, sa mga artists na uh, kasali today. Thank you. Um, pati sa mga nag-submit nung mga nakaraang episodes. And thank you, Martin Riggs, for being here. Thank you, sir. Thank you po. Uh, baka meron kang gustong i-promote or something? Uy, o nga. Um, well, continue on supporting the next Odd Creature. Tapos, um, always, um, maraming maraming salamat sa inyo, Odd Community, for supporting um, OC Artists and our uh, releases. Thank you, thank you so much sa lahat na nakikinig sa lahat ng mga OC Artists. And sa akin din, um, bilang artist, salamat. Maraming maraming salamat talaga sa inyo. Um, thank you for streaming Umaga. And um, I'm gonna be releasing uh, more music this year and sana um, nakikinig pa rin kayo salamat talaga sobrang salamat na appreciate ko kayo mahal namin kayo ad community thank you nice nice thanks martin how about you mark uh kian martin sir pao oc fam thank you guys for having me ad community thank you guys for uh letting me be here tapos uh grabe this is it's hard to judge kasi everyone's sound is different and it's hard to pick one it's just Because there's talent, eh. there's so much talent, and I'm um, super happy ako na I got to be a part of this and enjoy the sound trip. And I can't wait to find out who the next odd creature is going to be. Grabe. Yeah, bago album, Mark. Oh yeah, uh, I got an album coming out. It's called Gemini from the band Project Moonman, and a music video from one so of the proud. songs that are unreleased called Healing. I hope you guys can check it out when you have time. Only when you have time. Yeah. yeah. Pakinggan nyo si Project Moonman, napaka sipag, napakagaling na na artist. Diba kasama ko rin si Mark Thompson sa iba mga projects like iba uh, mga projects. project ko na um kaka-release ko lang ng bagong album. It's called Childlike under OC Records. So sana pakinggan nyo 3 years in the making tong album. And ano siya? Uh, I'm, I'm super proud of it. Kaya, yeah. So, yeah, this is uh, episode 4 of The Next Odd Creature. Um, find out uh, kung sino ang mananalo ng... Sorry, tama ba yung term ko na mananalo? Makakakuha ng 50,000 pesos plus management, management and recording deals sa OC Records. Um, ito rin yung simpleng paraan namin para... Um, magbigay ng platform at the same time eh, makatulong din sa mga aspiring artists, musicians. So yeah, I'll see you again next week for episode 5 of the Next Odd Creatures. Next Odd Creature lang pala. Or para malay mo magtay. Pero uh, yeah, pakinggan natin, malalaman natin next week kung sino yung um, pinaka napili dun sa past four episodes. So, abangan nyo yan. Uh, hanapin nyo kami sa Facebook, OC Records PH, Instagram, OC Records PH, pati sa Twitter. So, yeah. Basta, let's keep on keeping on. Um, stay safe. And, yeah. This is the next Odd Creature. Peace. Peace, yeah. Thank you, Oddcom. OC Records. Thank you, guys. And that's it for our fourth episode. Don't forget to tune in next week for another episode of The Next Odd Creature. Good night.